Hello, everyone, and welcome. Here we go. We've got two FIBA teams on tap tonight, and it's basketball time here on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Greg Anthony and Coach Dan Van Gundy. And joining us from the sidelines is David Aldridge. It's USA and the Chicago Bulls. Looking at the starting five for USA. We've got Durant, Anthony Edwards out there with Curry. And there's Embiid. And it's James in at the four-man position. And talk about effort. Embiid staying with that one. And so it's Pippen with it. He brings it up for the Chicago Bulls. Here's Jordan. And Curry pulls it down. Oh, this is exactly the kind of opportunity you don't want to waste. Got that one up quick. And Durant, so dangerous as a scorer. He can shoot it from deep, also beat you off the dribble there. He just stops and pops. Now, here is Jordan. Plays it up and banks it in. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. Yeah, well, his offensive contributions are going to be very important in this game. So it's good they've already got him in a rhythm. And we know how good Embiid is at drawing fouls, especially in the painted area. He welcomes the contact. It's his first trip to the line. Good on the second free throw. Now, here is Jordan. With the floater. And they call the foul, so he's got the and-one chance here to make it a three-point play. Man, the body control and focus. I mean, Jordan able to draw the foul and still finish the basket. Anthony Davis has checked in for MB. One shot. Free throw good, Jordan. The drive is the willpower of Michael Jordan is on a completely different level. He is competing every second he is on the floor and always looking for any way he can beat him. Now, here's Curry. Off target from outside. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. And that one, good. Jordan's got nine. And the way Jordan attacks, the ferocity of his drives does an exceptional job scoring after contact. Harper against Curry. And Davis now top of the key. They get a hand on it. Pippen with the steal. And Jordan has it in the corner. And Davis sends it back. What a play by Davis. You think you can get it over me? Nuh-uh. Not on my watch. Devin Booker, he's checked in for USA. And just under two and a half minutes elapsed here in the first. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Thank you, Kevin. I caught up with the Bulls head coach. We talked about a lot of things, including how to try and slow down Steph Curry. He said it's the usual stuff. You can't go under screens. You have to be a test without fouling. You have to recognize he will put the ball on the floor and drive if you overplay him. That's a lot to account for. Guys? Thank you, David. Here's Curry. Following the basket by Michael Jordan. Pass to LeBron. Davis with a screen on Rodman. Here's James. It's hauled in by Longo. The Bulls leading by three. Jordan drives in, and Jordan throws it down. And we've seen it. He, he can do this all game. Jordan with a great burst there to get the finish. Outside, KD. Bobbed up there for KD. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. And it doesn't even have to be an accurate pass. With Durant's length, you can just throw it up, and you know this guy will get it. And the foul called on Michael Jordan. That's foul number two for him. It really just a great play to sacrifice his body and take the charge. And that rejection had some mustard on it. Huge, huge play. And right out of the gate, trying to set the tone defensively, 
you got to love that energy. Two coach, he's checked in for Chicago. And then for USA, Embiid, he's checked in for LeBron. Mason Tatum comes in for Kevin Durant. And Halliburton subbed in for Curry. Jordan looking around. No good from outside. Longley against Tatum. Sweet little floater. Oh, perfect timing there to knock down the teardrop. And again, Chicago turns it over. And the misconnection there. Fans guarding their beverages. That's a pass he'd like back for sure. Near the three-point line, it's Booker. And so it's Michael Jordan making things happen for Chicago. He put together quite a quarter, 13 points in all. And he looks to be planning for more. We come back right after this. Some good action already in this one, but a fairly even matchup after the first quarter of play. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Bulls. Well, I like how they're going right at the defense, creating high-quality looks with that penetration. And the other thing I've been impressed with, guys, is their assertiveness at attacking the paint, trying to hunt for those high-percentage looks. Dennis Rodman is out there with Longley. Then it's Jordan. Then there's Pippen. And it's Kukoc in at the one. So that's the five in the game for Chicago. Now, here is Halliburton. Back to Tatum. And trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. Chicago leading. The drive by Jordan. And slam dunk by Jordan. And there are nights it really doesn't matter what you do defensively. MJ is going to score. And... This is looking like one of those nights. Halliburton against Kukoc. Halliburton kicks to Tatum. Davis down low. Over Rodman. And Davis can't get it to go. Just strong work defensively there in the low post. You got to be tough down in the paint. Yeah, that's an outstanding defensive stand in close. Now, here's Jordan. He's got 15. Back to Longley. Shot clock at six. A shot by Jordan. No good. USA trails by three. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldrich. Kevin, thanks. Devin Booker is a three-level scoring threat. He said, I'm just reading coverages and taking what the defense gives me. That's a mid-range jumper, which analytically people say isn't the highest percentage shot. But for myself, it's a good one. I've shot it pretty much my whole life. Kevin? And David, doesn't it show? Wow, he is something else. Hey, thank you. And there's the frame being put to use by Tatum. He knows he's dangerous down low. Here's Jordan. Outside, Longley. Back to Jordan. Rodman against Davis. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. For Chicago, they have shot just one free throw earlier. One for one in the game. That free throw, no good. And as a free throw shooter, Robin has his challenges. One of those guys who almost shoots a better percentage from the field. Catching up on the changes for USA. Durant's checked in for Davis. Edwards comes in for Booker. And it's Stephen Curry in for Halliburton. Now Jordan. After the missed three from Stephen Curry. And it's Jordan slamming it down. Oh, my goodness. The, the creativity, the athleticism of Michael Jordan. 144 left now here in the second. Edwards looking it over. Here's Embiid. Chicago grabs the miss. And that is the exact type of opportunity this offense is looking to create. Yeah, quality offense will serve you well in the long run. You can't settle for bad shots. Now here's Edwards following the miss by Michael Jordan. 
Uh, he's built like a linebacker, Edwards is. So tough to stop. USA shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. Davis has checked in for Joel Embiid. And Edwards drops them both. Well, he's been very good at the line, and we all know free throws can make or break you in the end. Here's Jordan. Outside for Pippen. Jordan inside. He's guarded by Davis. Kukoc dishes to Jordan. Makes a big high pounce and goes in. Jordan's got six in the quarter. And Jordan can score from anywhere on the floor. At least that's what he believes. Jordan with the steal. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed in the second quarter of play. Hodman passes to Jordan. And slam dunk by Jordan. Yeah, and right there, you see how quickly MJ gets into the air. Yet another one of his natural gifts. Curry fires from way outside. Long lead grabs the miss. Chicago leading by six. Definitely got to use the clock here and get the last shot. Yeah, but if you get an open look, you got to think about taking it no matter how much time is left on the clock. And Davis sends it back. With one on the clock, he can't get it to go. And so it's the Chicago Bulls with their lead standing at six points here at the end of the quarter. Their defense has been active and effective. We've got more in store for you right after this. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. You look at Michael Jordan in this game, he has been everywhere. His play so far is what fans love about him. He has gone right at the defense time and time again. Yeah, he hasn't been settling. He's getting to the rim, and that's him at his best. On the court for USA, we've got Joel Embiid. Curry is out there with Anthony Edwards. And it's LeBron James. And it's KD in at the small forward position. Now here's Edwards. Four on the shot clock. The three. And the shot is good. The Chicago lead has been cut down now to just three on the basket from Stephen Curry. Curry is just lethal from outside. And Jordan throws it down. Ooh. Oh, inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Ah, they're going for the throat. And here is LeBron. Scoreless thus far. Pass to Durant. USA moving the ball around. And the dunk by Embiid. And seeing a guy as big as Embiid being so fluid in terms of his movement, jaw dropping. Kicks it out to Rodman. Back to Jordan. It's hauled in by USA. Embiid's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. No one near Edwards as he lets it fly. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. Curry's got three assists now in this one. LeBron against Jordan. Over LeBron. 
Jordan with another miss. Yeah, and he had the D tangled up there with that patented crossover. Just couldn't convert the finish. So they take the lead. And it's seven points for Anthony Edwards. And this is who James is. A, a guy who's always looking to pass it and involve his teammates. Will it go? Jordan with the bucket. Jordan's got the game tied up here for Chicago. Important points there. Got him on a nice play. Getting the ball inside and right to the bucket. Outside Curry. Launches it. Another three for USA. Their ability, again, to stretch the floor, particularly in this second half. Yeah, and where has the defense been? They've been content to let them fire away. They've got to close out to the arc. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. And USA making a change here. Booker's checked in. One twenty-four left in the third quarter. Now Curry. He has six. Here's Embiid. On league grabs the miss. And we talk about the importance of protecting the rim. Right there, outstanding defense. And so it's Durant with it. He'll bring it up for USA. Three-point lead. 54 seconds left here in the third quarter. Good on the bucket. Just working his way inside there. Durant so good at just finding his shot all over the court. And Jordan gets it to go. And, and that's a great piece of work to get to the hoop there. Just tore the D to shreds. James looking around. Pass to Embiid from downtown. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. That's now eight points for Joel Embiid. <laughs> the big fella, Embiid, making it look too easy. Here's Jordan. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. That one on Embiid. Really uh, the right play defensively. If you can't block, force them to the line. The Bulls shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. And that one misses. And USA with some changes. Davis has checked in for LeBron. Jason Tatum comes in for Kevin Durant. Halliburton subbed in for Stephen Curry. Three seconds separate the shot clock and game clock. Here's Halliburton. Here's Embiid. Embiid is a load inside. You aren't going to get in his way. And showcasing that overwhelming strength. Embiid is so skilled at finishing over the aggressive defense. And how high can you fly? I mean, he finishes that one with some pop. GA after getting loose in the lane with a scintillating move. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And we've watched three so far in this one. USA ahead. They're up by five. And we're just moments away from the start of the fourth quarter. Stay with us. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. Yeah, that's high-level playmaking. He makes it look easy, but it's not. Three tenths quarters behind us. One more to go. Thanks for being with us as we begin the fourth. Pippen is out there with Rodman. Then it's Kukoc. Then it's Jordan. And it's Longley in at the five. So that's the five in the game for Chicago. The high percentage look for Jordan. It has every move you could ask for in the painted area. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for USA. Well, they've been absolutely on fire from deep. And until the defense offers more resistance, the coaches are going to keep encouraging them to let it fly. And also, guys, they push the ball and been able to score in transition, trying to take advantage of playing in the open floor as often as possible. It's rebounded by Booker. USA leading by five. And here's Edwards from the arc. It's rebounded by Jordan. 
And even against defense as tight as that, you almost expect him to still bury those. Outside, Rodman. Six on the shot clock. Drops in the layup for two. Jordan's got five points now this quarter. And guys, all about hard work from this point on. They've worked hard to create that high-quality shot and then able to knock it down. The USA calls time here. And USA with some changes. Embiid, he's checked in for Anthony Davis. James comes in for Jason Tatum. And Stephen Curry is subbed in for Booker. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Kevin, during the last break, I listened to USA's coach as he addressed his team. With the game in the balance, coach was calm in the huddle. His main message, execution. He told his team to make sure to remember what they talked about during shoot-around. We've got a great ending in store, guys. Thank you, David. Now, here's Jordan. After the miss from Joel Embiid. KD with it. Edwards getting the close range, too. Well, look, it's tough to keep Edwards out of the lane and tough to stop him once he's in there. Yep, it goes, and the USA lead is cut back down to three after the basket from Michael Jordan. James against Kukoc. Here's Embiid, and it's blocked. And they get it back. Second shot opportunity. That's good, and it's KD with the assist. KD's got three assists in the game. The drive by Jordan, and it's Jordan with the jam. Yeah, putting the team on his back as he often does. The tighter the game gets, the more Jordan wants the ball. Now here's Edwards. There's 138 left to play in the final quarter. No good with the wing jumper. Jordan inside. Edwards there. Jordan passes to Long. Jordan inside. Edwards defending. Yep, it goes, and the USA lead is cut down to just one on the basket from Michael Jordan. Uh, and that was the right call. I mean, you need a basket. Go to the guys you trust the most. Yeah, he got a good look, and he calmly delivered for them. That's what you like to see. To take the lead. Rodman kicks to Jordan. Pellet! Big-time basket at a big-time moment. Yeah, don't you just love to see a player embrace that kind of pressure? 56 seconds left in the fourth quarter. James outside. Pass to Embiid. Money! And there is no back down in Joel Embiid. He is ready to rise to the occasion in the big moment. Curry against Jordan. Money! Boy, I, I'll tell you, there's an art to doing this. What's amazing is how often Jordan hits the clutch shot. Now, USA with it. The USA calls time here. So I'm looking at the clock, and guys, the situation. What do you think we're going to see next? This is where great coaching can pay dividends. Well, they'll likely only get one shot at this. They need to make it count. 29 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. And in the big moment, Embiid is your guy. He's always ready to go on the attack. And here we go. A coach's challenge has been initiated. I have to now review the personal foul in question. And this is the time now where the officials can review Getting a different angle can sometimes make it a lot easier to determine. Indeed, and the one thing with replay review. Just the immense speed at which these players are moving. And how fast the action really is. And, and how hard it can be sometimes 
you know, Greg, to, to make the right call. And the announcement on the review is that the foul was called in air. So they have determined to overrule the original call. And guys, this is what it's all about, getting the call right. And I think in this case, the video review showed that while it was a tough call to make on the floor, they got it right with the review. And they still have a foul to give at this point. He's real good, Jordan. That's just clutch work, really. That's all you can say. A little bit of D now, and they'll be out of here with a win. Here's MD. Right on the first, and that narrows the gap to one. And he makes both free throws. Well, make no mistake, this is exactly who they want at the line in this situation. The Bulls call timeout. Jordan inside. Oh, couldn't sink the shot, and we're going to overtime. And regulation now complete. We will go to overtime. We'll take a quick break, then get you back to the action. Glad to have you with us as we get going in overtime. Neither team giving an inch in this one. Rodman is out there with Pippen. Then it's Longman. Then it's Tony Kukoc. And it's Jordan in at the shooting guard position. And how about the reach of Durant? A terrific job of having that on display defensively. And that's a lesson for the D. Fight harder on the glass. Yeah, they need to pay attention to the details. Second chance points are backward. And B showing his wings right there. Well, we talk about ice in his veins a lot. But this guy personifies that. What a clutch shot. Yet another bucket in close. That's how he's earning his points today. James against Rodman. And yet that, that's going to be a flagrant foul. Unnecessary content. Boy, a, a very hard foul that time. And the officials had to slap him with the flagrant. I mean, you can't let him get away with that kind of contact. Yeah, gee, that's an easy call for the officials to make when there's that much contact. The league is really cracking down on those sort of plays. Well, they had a chance for the lead right there. But we're all even done. LeBron outside, inside, MB, and the dunk by MB. Domination, plain and simple. MB isn't holding back and is giving the defense all he's got. Pippen with it, and Curry picks him up defensively. Durant with the steal. Three on three. Goes up the baseline, and that one comes up a bit short. And really, for some reason, just not a big part of their offense today. Hard to get into a rhythm when you're getting so few opportunities at the rim. Just a terrific all-around scoring effort from him. I mean, it's because of that that they're even in this game. To the paint. always hear about chemistry that's a perfect example knowing where each other is at all times it's Jordan with the drop yeah he makes it look so easy out there the game comes naturally to him James against Rodman James no good game could be on the line right here it's now or never it's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Jordan inside. Curry meets him. Good! And we'll see if they can finally hold on to a lead. It's been back and forth all night. Well, this is why the fans are here. Each team trading blows, increasing the entertainment value.
James outside. Curry, a screen on Rodden. Over to the left wing. Oh, wow, a huge basket to tie the game. And he's really made the most of his opportunities today. I mean, he needs to keep working for those kinds of looks. Here's Jordan. Come to me, come to me. Oh, no good there. The potential game winner off the mark. And so we are tied again at the end of overtime. Now we're headed to overtime number two. We've got more hoops coming your way in just a moment. And as we play into another overtime, the tension continues to build. Both teams refusing to quit. Here we go. Driving in. Oh, he just jams it right over LeBron. Wow. Yeah, reading the defense, knowing exactly what's needed at each moment. That's one of Jordan's unsung talents. And here's Embiid. He'll bring it up for USA. LeBron is screen on one. Fires from 18. Again, USA. And what a dominant performance he's put on here in overtime. He has been on an absolute tear. Jordan, the pass to Pippen. Back to Jordan. Five on the clock. Doesn't go for him. Great tee that time from Edwards. Pass to James. There's Embiid. It's hauled in by Longley. Longley's got rebound number seven for him tonight. A drive by Jordan. Oh, he just jams it right over LeBron. Wow. He got fancy with that one. Yeah, maybe trying to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. Now here's James. Tries from 10. Good! A huge shot to tie it up. And when you need a big score, you want LeBron to get the ball. And that's why. Huge bucket. I think the wrist's about to come off this place. The USA calls time here. So it's USA now. A two-point game. James dishes to Durant. Goes back up. Yes! He has tied up this game. Oh, what a shot. But when you need a bucket, he's your guy. Here's Jordan. It counts. And I'll bet his percentage is pretty high from that range. The USA calls time here. What do you think we're going to see here? And they've got plenty of time to get a basket. No doubt. But they might have to draw up something that the defense isn't expecting. Oh, the athletic move by LeBron James. Was there ever any doubt who they were going to go to? LeBron James is clutch. Curry against Jordan. Rodman outside. Back to Jordan. Yes! Able to get a layup out of that one. That's just soft defense there. For the win. Oh, that shot had a chance, but no good. And so the big win by Chicago in a tight game. The double overtime game can really take its toll on the players. And after this one, the officials, the fans... Everyone's going to have to take a, uh, a needed rest. Uh, no doubt. I mean, when you have to dig that deep and play with that much determination to get a win, it was earned. And I tell you what, they've got to feel really good about themselves for fighting through. And that'll wrap it up, folks. So for Stan Van Gundy, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, I'm Kevin Harlan. 
Thanks for watching the NBA on 2K Sports. But as we go, let's take a look at our player of the game, Michael Jordan.